Not even the one hit you've got them. Too much heavy armor. <sighs> Good morning and greetings, friends. A rest has uh, done brand our little good, if I am completely honest about things. It seems uh, the storm cloaks are not what I once thought they were. I suppose I uh, had a bit of an idealistic view, you see. But now I know differently. Ulfric could have had the throne had he just asked for it, but he decided not to do so. Uh, for what reason, I can only imagine. I am low in spirits, indeed. I came to this land thinking that I had uh, found some purpose. Uh, but what is the true purpose? Should I let this land be conquered by the Aldemary Dominion? Go apologize to the Empire for letting them down so many times? I had honestly thought that they were the bad guys. Perhaps it is me who is the bad guy. Ah, so much to think about. So much to consider. Hmm... Well, it is uh, you know quite a lovely morning, as it was the other day, but uh, a dark cloud still remains over Brandar. Oh, Rogvir, you got off easy, I tell you this, my friend. It's not much to ask. Ah, not much to think about when you're dead. Perhaps it would be easier for Brandar as well, hmm? A shame. A great shame. I was so excited to be a part of something that I suppose I did not uh, think deeply enough about what it meant. Mm. I suppose all I can do now is carry on. Brandar is no quitter. He will not simply lay down and die. As much as some people might like that. <laughs> Uh, let us see if my my friends are still at the farm as I asked them to be. Ah, hello to you, Miko. Come along, Richard. You as well. Ah, brings me little solace to be back with my friends, huh? Always by my side. Even if the others in this land might be snakes, every last one of them Imperial and Nord. What does the Dragonborn do? Ah, <sighs> Brandar. He's halfway tempted to retreat inside of himself. Disregard all of these things. There we are. Let's have a little swim, Richard. You miss this, don't you? Not as cold as the last time we went swimming. For those storm cloaks. <laughs> See how that turned out? Oh, yeah. This is what I get for doing favors, I suppose. Uh, but we should try out Maridia's blade. See if we might summon her through there. Or uh, perhaps it is all just fantasy and phantasms, hmm? Ah. Uh. Being a champion for Meridia could be just as uh, just as much of a letdown as fighting for the Stormcloaks, yes? Uh, it seems that uh, we might be doing some good, but then you look at it from the other side and you say, Oh, this is uh, not quite what I thought it was. The world, not so black and white. Hmm. I suppose I enjoy that, in a way. Brandar understands that. There were many, uh, back in Orc's Rest who supported the main blindly, without asking any questions, but then there were others similar to Brandar who thought maybe Valenwood should be left alone. 
Ah, and the answer probably is not one or the other. It's a gray area. Black and white. You know about black and white, don't you, Richard? Yes, he does. His world is black and white. Same for Miko, I suppose. He sees in black and white, I do, I do think. Come here, boy. Yes, you sit here, be good boy, okay? Wait for daddy. He'll come back. <laughs> hmm, here the robbers just ahead, huh? We must take great care around them. I have my, uh, my bow. So trusty it is. What a setup they have here, huh? Do they take any notice? I suppose they do. Greetings! Might I have passage this way for me and my animal friends? Hmm, they seem Is not so there? aggressive. Oh. And I'm proven wrong immediately. Oh my. Find out where that arrow stuck just a bit later, I suppose. Hello there! Please leave Nico alone. He's a good boy. He didn't do nothing. I must assist my friend. As we always do. Much loyal, much more loyal than the others we have met here. Are you okay? Miko, you're just hiding? That's a good boy. That's a good idea. Maybe Brandar should hide just for a moment as well. Wait for things to calm down. It's a little bit too hectic around here, isn't it? Oh, and you leave my horse alone. Not very nice of you. Right in the head. Down he goes, huh? <laughs> well, this is a bit more than I had hoped for. Oh, please do be careful, Richard. These bandits are not to be trifled with. And they are throwing magic. Ah, always with the magic. Well enough. We shall have a, a bit of exchange of blows here. Are you enjoying that volley? Ha! Brandar is too quick for your arrows. You'll make a fine rug, cat! A fine rug, they say. <laughs> that is if you can catch me. Oh! You did catch me. Just a little bit. Just a flesh wound, huh? Ah, Nico is there now. Wonderfully ah. done, my little friend. Huh? My do? furry little friend. Coming to the defense of Brandar. Ah, uh, we give them no quarter. Hmm. Now, let's see what goods they might hold for me. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't want it to be this way. Oh my goodness! Where did you come from? Quite eager for a fight, you are, huh? How's that? <laughs> ah, that's right. So brave. Not much brains on you, though, huh? Ah, not much of anything on that one. I care not for these things. Heavy armor. Not good for the sneaking. Oh my, and I seem to have uh, stripped him. Stripped him completely. I do apologize for that. My goodness, how could I be so clumsy? Ah, oh, well, well. We'll try out this dawn breaker at some point. I think that should be quite nice. Here are your weapons back. Don't want to uh, put them on you. Kind of not my thing to dress a man up and down, you see? Where's, where's this dog? Oh, good boy! Good boy! 
You stay here, okay? I tell you to stay before, you don't even listen. So eager for the combat he is. He does remind me of my brother. Even a similar name. Hmm. Fortune. Fortune has a way of finding Brandar. What is this lever? What is the other? Hmm. I know not what these things do. I suppose it isn't so smart to touch something that I don't know what its full purpose is. But it's also a good way to find out. Oh, the chief! Here he is! The bandit chief! Far too powerful for the fear of my dagger. I think that these flames should do their work. Ah, Nico! Good to see you, my brother. Here we are. I must be careful. The dog seems to be getting a bit in the way. As dogs are one to do. So hungry for combat they are. What's this? I stand on table. You know, get Brenda. <laughs> Ah, not even the one hit you've gotten. Too much heavy armor. You should consider the lighter armor, friend. It might serve you a bit better. Now I'm up here. And you're down there. <laughs> ah, no wonder these bandits were taken so easily. Their chief? Hmm. Not an ounce of brain in his head. Bad enough, have you? No. Get up. Do not submit. Have some pride, would you? <laughs> ah, said as I blast him in the back with flames. You did start this fight, I want you to remember that. Hmm, quite a nice dagger he has. Yes. And the key. To what, I can only imagine. But they are uh, bandits. So there's probably a stash of loot around here somewhere. Ah, helpful to take my mind off things, yes indeed. Anybody here? There is some treasure. Another key as well. I could have done just a bit of sneaking. It had the same results, but... Brandar does not fear combat. Not in these days and times. Come now. Hmm. And my sack. My sack, so hungry. For the, the delicious treats. Yes, I shall take most of this. This elven armor. So light. Hmm. I should uh, like to learn how to enchant these things. I think that would be quite useful. Ah, there's some ore. Maybe smithing my own weapons would not be uh, something to scoff at either. But at the moment I'm not so knowledgeable, unfortunately. At some point in the future, let's put it on the list. The long list that we have. The infinite list. Hmm. Plenty of ore left over here. And I shall leave it for the next adventurer. Someone who knows a bit more what to do with it than Brandar does. The Black Arrow. Interesting. It's the second part. I'm sure I've seen the first. Ah, I don't feel much like reading. I will sit down and clear my mind for just a moment. Ah, yes. Very good. Feel my magical powers growing. This is always a nice thing, huh? <laughs> hmm. But in order for my flame skill to get even better, I must uh, spend a bit more time casting. A bit less time slashing. You know how that one goes, friends. Such as it is. 
Hmm. And I'm relatively close to learning how to uh, pick up some of these wonderful one-handed techniques as well, but hmm, not quite yet, huh? Dual wielding attacks are faster. It's not such use for me, I think. Hmm, steady hand, not quite. Long shot, also not quite. My goodness. Crippling shot. Hmm. This could be quite nice. Do not let the foes get close, huh? Yes, I think this is what I lean towards. I recover more arrows from dead bodies. We have plenty of arrows. Worry not about this. Take the crippling shot. Wonderful. Ah, and I even have room for one more. One more of something. Hmm. Less damage from enemies at full health. Not quite, not quite. Hmm. How about this initiative? Ah. It's quite nice, a bit more stamina could help me. Interesting. Keen senses. No longer need to wear a helmet. Renard does not much like the helmets, you see. Hmm, unarmed damage? No, this is not mine either. Well, well. Perhaps a bit of alchemy might uh, improve me. Improve me in more ways than I can consider at the moment. Ah. Eating an ingredient reveals all effects. Of course. This is what I require. Ah, so many ingredients I have wasted now. Ah, but no matter. Looking back, one always knows the proper thing to do. But it is when we look forward to the future. That is how we move. That is how we keep going and improving. Hmm. Quite a little cave they had down here. Just a few septums. A little chest. Yes, I don't mind if I do. Iron helmet. Ugh. None of this for me, please. Bandit Leader's Journal. What were you up to here? Idiots. Broder and Herd were at each other's throats again today. It nearly came to blows. The whole camp's on edge. I've ordered an extra ration of meat, but unless this fighting stops, we'll tear ourselves apart. Rumor is that Herd's gathering followers for a mutiny. Broder's not stupid. He's probably doing the same, just for insurance. I'd kill them both myself, but the camp split right down the middle. If I tried, there'd be a knife in my back within a week. I can't take this anymore. I began skimming a little gold from the take, bringing it down here when I can. If I can scrape enough together, I'll make a run for it, head down river to Dragon Bridge. Brodeer's getting suspicious. I caught him poking around in the cave this afternoon. I don't think he found my stash, but it's not safe here. I took the boat out tonight and stowed it on the island to the south by the old tree stump. Had a good haul this week, another caravan or two, and I could finally get out of here, and not a moment too soon. Oh, seems a bit of dissension in the ranks, hmm? Well, wh what else would you expect, huh? Spend your whole life putting daggers in other people. You must expect the daggers to come back your way, yes? Hmm, it seems quite a swim. Brandar won't bother with it. I should uh, find some water walking potions. That might help me out somewhat. Get my feet a little wet, but hey, we could explore some wonderful new places. Hmm. Brandar hears bugs. Perhaps it is just flies. Flies making a home in this fellow. Or what used to be a fellow, hmm? <laughs> ah, bear trap as well. My goodness. 
They took no chances out here, I think. Have you seen Nico? Hmm. Fascinating. Ah, I hear you. Good boy. Always uh, blending in with the surroundings you are. Come along. We have much work to do. Little time to do it. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.